We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept, one we are unwilling to postpone, and one we intend to win. Okay, we've had a problem here. This is Houston, say again, please. Oh, here's the way back home. We've had a couple of cardiac arrests down here, too, Pete. There wasn't any time for that up here. We choose to go to the moon because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Okay, 30 seconds to lift off. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. a new and strange environment at first, this suddenly finding yourself in orbit. Or probably the most impressive thing that you would see in orbital flight, these are very brilliantly colored and uh, the colors stretch out way out from the sun to the horizon. The horizon stays light for, I would estimate, some four to five minutes. I got on this project because it'd probably be the nearest to heaven I'd ever get, and I wanted to make the most of it. But uh, my feelings are that this whole project with regard to, to space sort of stands with us now as, as, if you want to look at it one way, like the Wright brothers stood at Kitty Hawk about 50 years ago with Orville and Wilbur pitching a coin to see who was going to shove the other one off the hill down there. Okay, the altimeter is active at 65. Roger, 65 south. Okay, I'm getting some contrails, evidently a shock wave. 50,000 feet, I'm feeling good. Okay, the G's are starting to build. Roger, reading a loud and clear. G's are building, we're up to six. Main chute is green. Main chute is coming unraced and it looks good. Tranquility base here. The Eagle has landed. Roger, Twain. Tranquility, we copy you on the ground.
Today we are introducing to you and to the world these seven men who have been selected to begin training for orbital space flight. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept, one we are unwilling to postpone, and one we intend to win. This is Houston, say again, please. Oh, uh, Houston, we've had a problem.